Okay, drawing a black-eyed Susan today. I'm using a Prismacolor marker that is an alcohol-based uh, marker. It is uh, art alcohol, not a drinking-based alcohol, so there you go. Uh, what I did there was filled in the background with a, just a broad color. Uh, the ends of this marker, there's one end that's a, a real fine point, and the other end is a, a more of a blade for wider shapes. So uh, what I did was this is kind of a, a reversed way of drawing, kind of a positive-negative thing, where um, you're almost making like a silhouette uh, to start out with your uh, of your subject. Um, I'm using the green because I'm going to fill in the background there with some green. So you take the fine tip end of that marker and just pick out your leaf shapes here. Um, just kind of go random. You don't have to think about them ahead of time being so perfect. Because um, nature is very organic and odd shaped and wonderful. So just fill it in. You'll be all right. Um, taking the blade end here and just knocking in some color. Uh, you don't have to worry about running over those edges. You can come back with that little fine tip again and kind of cut those in and make them, make them correct. Um, and you run it out to the edges there, you know, out at the edge of the page. You don't have to to um, to dive into some kind of leaf shapes um, you're kind of letting your eye kind of fill in some of that stuff you know it'll focus in on the flower and then just imagines that the green is indeed grass and leaves and bugs and whatever else is out there now take that brown marker that we did the center with and pick in some little star-shaped kind of where the leaves fold into the center and then with a yellow kind of a yellow ochre come back and kind of just highlight a little bit where those edges are uh, coming back with that yellow again and filling this in a little stronger so it's not so streaky in one direction and I'm not filling in the back edge with the green because I just don't feel like it. So, good enough. That's a lighter green just to give a little bit of variety. And then uh, I'm going to fix that big leaf right there that kind of bugs me. So, I'm going to just make it look like that leaf is bending over and um, disappearing. And I'd say that looks like it is done.